Hello and welcome to this Technic Force tutorial. In this video, I am going to show you how to install two cloud funnels in one domain. Cloud funnels lets you put multiple funnels in one domain. Yes, you heard it right. You can have each funnel in its own folder and sell as many different funnels as you want. Plug in your cPanel account. We are going to install cloud funnels in the same domain using a folder or subdomain. The question is, how do you install under root? Go to the main section and click domain. You will see tons of domains. It has main domain and subdomains. Beside, these are the folders. It is where you can upload and store your cloud funnels. In this case, since we are in makemarketers.com, we should have this public HTML as our folder. This is actually the main root of the domain makemarketers.com. Click the public HTML folder. Click on the upload located above name and upload your Cloud Funnels file in zip format. If you want your file to be uploaded in a subdomain, go to home page and click the subdomains under domains so you can use this as an alternative to the folder. To set this up, start by creating a subdomain. Enter your subdomain name, your main domain, and you will have your document root directly. Hit create. You can now upload your file by clicking this as what we did in public HTML folder. When it's done, reload your page and extract your file in main root domain by right clicking and selecting extra. Take note that you have to make sure you are extracting your cloud funnel zip file in your root directory that is inside public HTML only. It is now extracted. After this, pull up this link, makemarketers.com, to visit your site URL. You will see this bar. Select your language. In my case, I'll leave it to English. Secondly, you have to fill out this database, the credentials. To log in, go back to your cPanel account. Scroll down a little bit, and inside database, click this MySQL databases. Enter your new database. For example, I'll have it C Cloud and hit Create Database. Now that it is created, click this Go Back button. Going back, we also have to create our MySQL user. For example, I'll have my username C Cloud. And when entering your password, you can just click this password generator. Make sure that you saved your ID to a notepad. Click Use Password, hit Create. It is now created. Going back again, we have to assign the database to a specific user which we created before by adding user to database. You have your user and select your database. Click Add. You will see this Manage User Privilege and select All Privileges. Hit Make Changes. Now that everything is ready, let us now go back to our Cloud Funnels and add these database credentials. My database username is cCloud and will enter my password. Enter your database name. No need to enter this port and hit Submit. Next thing is to create an admin user account by entering your name. In my case, I'll enter Chris. Enter your email ID and the password. You can now log in to your account. To set everything up, you must first verify your membership. To do it, copy your URL and go to the Cloud Funnels Membership Plugin. On the left sidebar, click this Your Installation. Hit Generate License and paste your site URL. And click Generate New License button. You will now see your license code. Copy it. Go back to your Cloud Funnels Membership Verification. Enter your membership email ID that you used when you logged in and paste your license code. Hit verify. Your account is now verified. Congrats! You can now create a funnel. Now that everything is set up, let us save your cloud funnel into a folder or subdomain. On the top left corner, click folder to create one. Enter folder name. Let me have C Cloud as my folder name. Hit Create new folder. It is now created. Click it and upload your zip file. 
While waiting, we must create database again by going to MySQL database. Enter your new database name. Let me have CCloud Funnel as an example. Next is to create new user again. Add your username and your password. Again, you can use password generator to set your password. Save it in a notepad and hit create. It is now created. Add user to the database you created by going back and scrolling a little bit. You will see this add user to database. Add user and the database you created. Again, you have to make sure that you click all privileges and make changes. And vice versa. Everything is in the same process. If you want to install more cloud funnels, just repeat the process to create more and more database. That's how it is. I hope you like this tutorial. We also have a bunch of tutorials and cloud funnels in this channel. Take a look and you might also find tutorials about the other apps too, which will help you succeed in internet marketing. Thanks for watching!